Happy Saturday, guys. I know I haven't really been vlogging that much this week. Um, and my last vlog went up late, so I'm sorry about that. Long story short, I didn't really do anything this week. I, I knew most of the action would be this weekend, so I was just like, let me just save it. Still got the hair in, loving it, you know. I added a few more pieces just to, you know, look a bit more full than last time. So this weekend has been really interesting. It's pretty much been me conquering my fears, especially when it comes down to, uh, um, I've shot a gun this weekend for the first time. But it's my best friend's birthday this weekend. And our other best friend was like, hey, you know, let's go ski shooting. And it's pretty much when someone says, pull, psh, and you just, you know, aim and shoot. Um, you can shoot it. All right. And it was something that I've I've always been like anti-gun because I'm from Chicago. I got PTSD in a way. You know, everything with the world that's going on is just a mess and I just rather not deal with it. Uh, but me being in Texas, it's like a it's like a culture thing out here. So and I was like, well, it's in a controlled environment and I've never touched a gun before, so let alone shot one. So um yeah, I was just like, okay, sure, fine. You know, let me not be a wet blanket or anything. Let me just try it. And it was actually really fun. It was actually fun, guys. Like, in a controlled environment, like, it's really interesting. And it's really, it's like a real adrenaline rush when you, like, you know, hold something that powerful, heavy. You know, you pop one. Um, I was shooting the little ski balls and I actually hit one. So, I, I'm really proud of myself, if I do say so myself. Um, also to give you some updates about myself, actually let me go back and huh? the lighting is better. Also what made this uh, weekend interesting is I got a COVID vaccine. Um, so I work in health and everything so I, you know, I was pretty much in the phase, earlier phases. I qualified for the earlier phases, phase one and phase two um, and I got a COVID shot this past Friday. It wasn't that bad. Um, this is the Moderna one, and it's, so it's two shots. I get my next one next month. They said that symptoms happen with your second shot, um, so we'll see about that. I'll keep you guys updated, but yeah, I got my shot. No symptoms. Um, the only thing is, like, I, it's a little sore, but I, you know, nursing school, all that other stuff, um, they make you get immunization shots, and my DPAP, Either my DPAP or my meningitis shot hurt more than this. Um, I did have to drive over 50 minutes to uh, get a shot. And when that was done, it was done. Just, it's crazy how we're coming upon a year of COVID. And this is, I'm now taking a vaccine that wasn't even real. Like, wasn't even a thought a year ago. This time last year, I was in Miami for spring break, y'all. That's how real it was. But we're going to go to... Perry Perry or Peli Peli tonight. It's a South African restaurant, so I'm excited. I love um, South African food, especially the chicken and the mashed potatoes. If you haven't had it, it's really good. Um, yeah, I'm going to insert some clips um, throughout this whole time me talking because y'all don't want to see my face. I mean, I know I look, you know, I'm not, you know, ugly or anything, but I know you want to see some actual vlog clips. So, yeah. How much that? <laughs> it smells great. Take your time. <laughs> Take your time and make a wish. And smile. <sighs> it has been a long mother fucking night okay and the food was good it was really good so pele pele and the galleria really good i would highly recommend them um especially if you want something different the atmosphere is decent they have a lot of good 
if you go to the Galleria, it's going to be hella stores. It's very expensive. It's really big. You're going to spend a lot of time in there. They have multiple restaurants, high-end restaurants, and one of them is Pele Pele. So it's really good. So I would recommend. And we celebrated my friend's birthday. So I was really happy. Gosh, we are inching towards the 30s, y'all. Like, we're not 30s yet. Like, I'm not 30 yet, but it's coming, baby. Sit up and realize, like, Jackie, like, you're just getting older and like if you take care of yourself life will be just fine life will just be getting started for you so you just gotta do it for yourself so yeah um to go wash my makeup off you know when you have to spend some time in the mirror i had to spend some time in the mirror making sure i got some cute pics you know but I love my glasses, y'all. I don't know if you noticed, but I did get my glasses back. I had to get them fixed. Um, actually, I don't know if I showed myself on the camera with these glasses, but this is like, these glasses are really cute. I love the shape. I love how thin they are. My face can show. Like, it's just really cute. I think it really fits my aesthetic, so I love it. All right. But tomorrow, Sunday, I gotta get up because I gotta make mac and cheese and all that stuff, so... Yeah. Talk to you guys later. Good night. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> Sorry, Jackie. No, you're fine. Look at his bone. That's good though. Yeah, oxtail. Mm -hmm. Oh, you got fruit. Nice. Sweet. All right. Can y'all see me? Can y'all see me? I am getting ready to pack up. I am making my. I don't know if you can see, but I'm making my Hello Fresh meal. This is the uh, zucchini garlic flatbread. I'm watching some DK4L. They just bought their house, so that's really nice. I don't know if y'all watch them, but yeah. Let me wipe this camera. I'm going home to Chicago, y'all. So I gotta pack the F up and. I'm not gonna lie to you, I wanted to reschedule my flight to Wednesday, but now it's gonna be like, <sighs> now it's gonna be uh, tomorrow, which is Tuesday. I gotta pack all my stuff up, I gotta get my work stuff together because I still plan on working remotely and stuff. But yeah, I was looking forward to um, staying an extra day at home but guess not like ugh I low key want to possibly pay for a check back I don't know I'm exhausted already but I'm just gonna hurry up and just not think about it just do it check the price for um, a carry on bag and just do like that I'll talk to y'all later bye We are here. We are in Chicago. Um, I am just with my family right now. Actually, let me. I feel like I'm very in your face. I'm so sorry. I'm in the guest room, and um, it's my grandma's birthday today. Um, I posted a picture of her um, on Instagram. I'll insert it here or something like that. But um, or go on my Instagram and go, you know, click on it, give it a like. I appreciate it. You know, if you've seen my first vlog, you'll know, like, that was the time that she passed. And, you know, we just had her funeral. And now I'm back home in Chicago. Just, you know, pay, just, it's her birthday today. She would have been 81 years old. So, um, I'm going to take you downstairs. We're making tacos tonight. And we're watching Coming to America 2. We're actually watching the first one because there's a lot of us young people up in here. So, you know, we got to, some of us need to know what refresh our memory. And then we're going to watch the coming to America too, so come, come with your girl. Hey, mommy. Hey, we're watching it.
Oh. Oh, hey, what's good? Man, came on that corner with the camera. Hey, y'all. 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 Hey, y'all.